They say it's the thought that counts, but some thoughts should have probably been kept to themselves. Welcome to the list of the worst gifts I've ever received during Teacher Appreciation Week from principals. Let's start with number five. Number five is an assorted bag of melted Jolly Ranchers. That's right. These Jolly Ranchers look like they had been in the sun for a long time and had melted. And yet someone had the tenderness and care to put them in a sandwich bag and put them in my mailbox. That's great. Number four, a set of blank cassette tapes. I don't even know what I would do with blank cassette tapes. (laughs) <laughs> in this era, like, what are you doing? Uh, someone must have saw them at the dollar store and said, oh, great, this will make sense. Number three, four sharpened pencils. The pencils didn't have the logo on the school or say, happy teacher appreciation week or we love you or thank you or anything like that. They're just four just random <laughs> number two pencils. Good pencils, but yeah, four pencils. Number two, socks that had the school's name on it but the name of the school was misspelled. I'm not going to even touch that one. How come you don't know how to spell the name of the school you were principal at? And number one, the worst gift I've ever received during Teacher Appreciation Week, a can of Coke and a mini bottle of Thunderbird. That's right, Thunderbird. If you are drinking Thunderbird, you don't need to be around kids. If you're drinking anything in the Thunderbird, Cisco, Mad Dog family, you don't need to be around kids. But yet, it was given as a gift. I say all this to say, principals, if you have not given your staff a great gift, please do so at this time. I've gotten tons of great gifts during the time, but I know that many teachers receive bad gifts. Hey, give a little, you'll get a lot from the people that care about the future. Happy Teacher Appreciation Week.